loose with wild animals. Wait, let me paint a better picture for you. How about jumping into murky water to catch an alligator snapping turtle? Who does that? Coyote Peterson, animal expert and adventurer, that's who. His YouTube channel, Brave Wilderness, has over 15 million subscribers. Such a pleasure to chat with you today about your new adventure, Coyote. How are you? I'm fantastic, Jen. Thanks for having me on the show. Well, first of all, my kids are proud to say that they're part of the Coyote Pack. That is very exciting. Please tell them thank you for being such brave members of the pack. Um, and, and everybody who watches our content is, is considered a member of the Coyote Pack. If we're getting kids of all ages, three to 93, excited about animals, we're doing the right job. Because I know that you get up close, you're not scared at all. <laughs> uh, to get up close with these animals, most people would say, he's crazy. How, how can you get so close? Where does it come from? You're obviously very passionate. Um, well, what's, what's amazing is, is it's snapping turtles. And I'm, I'm very excited for everybody there in Texas because our premiere episode, a large part of it actually takes place in Cleveland, Texas, where I caught the largest alligator snapping turtle I think that has ever been featured on camera. An absolute giant. This thing is a living dinosaur. Um, you know, they say everything is bigger in Texas, and that is definitely <laughs> the case. Um, but it was snapping turtles that started my love for um, this journey that became teaching the world about bizarre creatures. Most people don't recognize or realize what a snapping turtle is, whether it's a common snapping turtle or an alligator snapping turtle, but both of these animals deserve their time in front of the spotlight. I did get a sneak peek and I did get to learn a little bit more about them thanks to you. So thank you for all you do. If it's okay with you, I had my daughter record a question. If you want to listen for it, she's going to ask it. Hi, Katie. I'm your biggest fan. I have a bunch of pets. I want to ask you a question. How furry is a koala? Thank you for the wonderful question, Julia. Koalas are incredibly soft, but here's something you probably didn't know. They smell like cheese. <laughs> they may be adorable, but they are not the best smelling marsupial on the face of the planet. The males actually have this little scent gland on their chest that they will like rub up on the, the bark of trees. A koala is one of the stinkier creatures that you can ever work with, but <laughs> what they, they have in sync, they definitely balance out with their adorable nature. I did not know that. Well, thanks for sharing. And what is the scariest encounter that you've ever had? Uh, probably one with grizzly bears on the side of a river in Alaska. Mm -hmm. um, I was actually put into that same scenario that you saw in that film, The Revenant, with Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, a mother bear, her three cubs, 100 yards in closing, and fortunately we were able to scare the bears off and were not attacked. But it was without question the scariest animal encounter I've ever had because if a mother bear decides she's going to defend her cubs, trust me, you're not going to be able to get away. <laughs> wow. I, I don't know how you do that. Speaking of scary, I know you've been bit, you've been stung. My son Rai Rai has a question for you. Hello, Coyote Peterson. My name is Rai Rai. What animal bite was the most painful? I would only say about 2% of the content we've produced is the bite and sting content, where I'm intentionally bitten or stung by something to show you the effects of the bite or the venom. Um, obviously, this is a content that people have found very fascinating. It still has quite the educational spin on it. But when it comes to the most painful bite of ever taken, it was actually an accidental bite from the only venomous lizard in the United States, which is called the Gila Monster. And that simply happened by getting a camera too close, it latched onto my thumb, and let's just say that was the most painful day oh. I've ever had to endure. My goodness, okay. Well, we love going along on your adventures. Let's talk about your new show on Animal Planet. So Coyote mm -hmm. Peterson, Brave the Wild. Uh, this show is just fun, right? So if you've seen the, the YouTube content, you know it's fast paced, we get you into the environment, we get you up close with the animals, but Brave the Wild is a longer form narrative, right? We're telling 30 minute to hour long episodes and there's so many animals packed into each and every single episode, right? 79 animals featured within the first season and every single adventure feels like I'm literally grabbing you by the hand, taking you with me off into the wilderness and you never know what's gonna happen next. So when I say it's fun, I promise it's gonna deliver for kids of all ages. Doesn't matter if you're three years old or you're an adult or you're 93 years old, this is the show for you if you love animals and adventure. Thank you, Coyote, for being such an inspiration to everyone, all the animal lovers like myself, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Thanks, Jen.